Meet some of NATO's cutest allies. As part of NATO's Explosive Ordnance Disposal Unit, these highly skilled dogs are taught to sniff out explosives and warn their handlers of possible danger. This past month, a group of NATO's dog handlers met at a sports arena in Lithuania to learn new tactics and train with their fluffy friends. We are training for the explosive search. So we have the dogs and they do most of the work. Of course, we need to give them, them directions, but they use their noses, their senses, and they're supposed to show us where the explosives are. This is the playing together with the dog. And it's very, very important to play together, the handler and the, and the dogs. And after then, when he found the different types of explosives, uh, every dog is very, very happy because after that he had a chance to play together with the handlers. <laughs> Sorry. Package. The, the work from a dog is with his nose, and that can be achieved, in my point of view, with a, with a machine. That's for me the biggest difference between a machine and a dog. And also, like I said before, uh, you have a connection with your dog. And I like more this, this type of job because you can uh, play with them. Uh, with a machine, you can play. You do your job, you, you put it again, uh, in, a, in a box and it's finished. Here, you're never finished. You're always busy with your dog. And that's what I like about it. For more news, head to militarytimes.com or follow us on social media.